34 right now. We've been talking about it all week. The UNO Mavs take on Air Force tonight for the big game. Yes, you can no longer get season tickets, but you may still be able to get in. Jenna Jane joins us now with how you can score some tickets. Jenna, good morning. Good morning, Dave and Cerise. Happy Fall Fun Friday. This has been huge. Season tickets for the Mavs sold out in just about one week. It's no surprise since this year they're set to have a standout season. When the team played at the CenturyLink, players admitted that despite having the same size crowd, it just didn't give them that home ice advantage because there was no way to really fill that arena. But now at Baxter, with seats tight on the ice and a more intimate feel, they're hoping the arena is shaking with cheers and an intimidating atmosphere. It's just great knowing that going into not only opening night, but every game this year, we're going to have a full house. This, this base, place is going to be packed, it's going to be loud, uh, and knowing that this community is behind us, just like they've always been, is, is awesome for us. If you don't have tickets, it's not the end of the world. UNO officials say they're still trying to figure out just how much standing room they'll have available at these games, so there may be some 40 to 60 tickets released later today. Plus, you're going to want to download the MAV Experience app. It has everything you need to know from what's interesting near where you're seated to special events. It even shows you all your food options like typical concessions to carving stations, day series. You need to check out that food option because everything there sounds so delicious. Plus, hey, Alcohol is on the menu here at Baxter. And that's rare at college sporting events. That's true. So that's pretty cool. We had a raffle here at the station for tickets for UNO mm -hmm. yesterday. That sheet was like this long to sign up for. They Did you get in? I didn't because I couldn't go this weekend. Oh, okay. <laughs> Maybe next time. All right, Jenna Jane's reporting this morning. Jenna, thank you.